One of the areas of great interest as we learn about Alzheimer's disease and the risk factors is studying vascular function. If you go to your doctor's office and wanted to know how good your cardiovascular health is, there are some series of tests that your physicians would do. Um, and these would include measurement of blood pressure, measurement of your cholesterol profile. What we've learned over the last several years is that vascular risk factors, uh, things like diabetes, high blood pressure, those types of things are among the greatest risk factors for Alzheimer's disease. So what we often need to know is if, if the structurally the arteries are becoming hardened and if this plaque was to progress you would get blockages and have consequences of that. So we can take an image of the carotid artery and measure the thickness of the arterial wall. What we are able to do by doing these tests is to study the blood vessels in great detail and pick up changes way before anything manifests itself. And what we want to see is whether there is a relationship between health of our blood vessels and the risk of development of Alzheimer's disease.